Uh, yeah, um, he drew up the play uh, for me um, <clears throat> to get that same ISO, but I, I just felt like um, Kai had to go in the whole fourth. Um, to start the fourth, he made big shots. He made tough shots all fourth. I came in there, you know, I usually come in there about five, six minutes in the fourth, seven minutes sometimes, and he already cooking, so I don't want to get in his way. Um, so we, we kept finding him late in the game. He made some big shots. And I was just like, Jog, I think I think Kai should take this one, you know, especially since he had uh, Van Fleet. Not saying he's a bad defender, but they the same size. He didn't have a six nine Barnes on him or a six five guy on him. They had a guy that was a size. So um, I felt like he was he can get whatever he want there. And I also felt like they wasn't going to run and double him either at the top of the key because he obviously could just beat that. So they let him play one on one, and I man, it was a special special shot. What? I'm um, just playing free. I mean, that's just who he is. That's, he's a free spirit, and uh, he, he he takes that approach on the court. Um, he never rattled. He never feels like he sped up. Um, and we trust him, you know. And he, he knew once he got into his move and, and and pulled up for a shot, it was a wide open look. And he's a you know, all-time great shooter. So, you know, I had confidence that as soon as he let that, he, he rose up for the shot that it was going in. I, I, I'm sure everybody back in Brooklyn and all the team, everybody on the bench felt the same way. What changed? I mean, you guys, essentially, you're down 18, and you go on this extended 35 to 14 run, what have you. What was it that changed? Was it just a matter of playing harder? Uh, yeah. Yeah, we ramped up our pressure a little bit. We got we got into the ball a little bit more, and I think that sped them up, and we was able to get some stops. Um, you know, so yeah, I think I think we I wouldn't say we played harder. I just think we we made a, a quick adjustment to up our pressure on the ball, our point of attack defense. Uh, we sw we were switching out a little bit. Um, uh, we were switching out, you know, closer to the ball. We wasn't playing off our man, so they can just ride, drive around us or shoot. But I just think we were aggressive in everything that we did on the defensive side, and it fed onto the offense, and we was able to get over that hump and get a lead going to the fourth. Defensively, how big was making that quarter? I mean, he was huge. Six blocks. Um, six blocks. I mean, he blocked their center twice at the rim, you know, and that's that's tough to do. And then, you know, so that makes everybody else a little nervous coming into the paint. So he uh, he protected it for us tonight, and you know we're gonna need that going forward. How would you describe the confidence level you guys have now, five in a row, nine and ten? Yeah, I think we just figure out uh, we kind of understand the way we want to play, um, and I think that's always the good part about finding your identity in the league is that. Um, now you can start relaxing a bit, going into games, preparing when you know your role, you know you understand exactly how we want to play the game. Uh, so everybody's coming in more relaxed and, uh, you know, but also with a sense of urgency knowing, like, all right, this is what we do. This is the type of team we are. And I think we're building that every day. We always talk about just stacking them up, just keep stacking them days, and I think um, everything matters. So we add another game into the pot. We watch it tomorrow, see how we can get better.